Hi students, welcome back to the channel. So in this video, we are going to discuss HTML mark you with image tag. So in previous lectures, we have already discussed image tags and mark you tags in details. So here I am going to tell you that with the help of mark you tag, how you can scroll any image. In previous lecture 12 and 13, we have discussed that by using a mark you tag, we can scroll text, we can scroll any paragraph. And now we will discuss that with the help of mark you tag, you can run any image. Is it possible or not? We will discuss everything in detail. So we'll start with the theoretical section and after that we will move to the practical part. So let's move to the theoretical section first. So I am uh, revising it for you that HTML mark you tag is just to scroll a piece of text displayed either horizontally across or vertically down on your web page depending on the settings. That means it depends on your requirement that you want to uh, scroll your text, you want to scroll uh, your image or anything in a web page. Okay, so to scroll any text, any image, we always write mark you tag. And in mark you tag, we have uh, so many attributes like uh, basic attributes are direction. Second is its background. Third is margin. Fourth is its speed. Next is its loops. There are so many uh, attributes that we can use with mark you tags. So we have already discussed everything in previous lectures. If you have not seen it so you can check the description box. So next tag we are using here in this video is image tag. So if we want to add any image, we always write it as only IMG. So if we write only IMG, that means this tag is just here to capture the space for the entire system, for the entire tag. It does not do anything. It does not help us to paste any image in our, uh, in our web page. Okay. So, if we want to exactly add any image to our web page, we need to use source. We need to use source along with, this is SRC. We need to add source with this image tag. Okay. So, this is how we write the syntax of image tag. So, ING SRC image URL. So, in this video, we will discuss how you can use both these tags together and run a complete web page. So, let's move to the practical section. So, here I am writing first HTML. Next section is head. Next, what we write is title. So, here I am writing uh, title is image with mark you tag. You can write anything here, okay? Now we need to close the title tag. After that, we need to close the head tag. So head tag is very, very important. Uh, web page mein, if you want to set the upper section of your web page, so everything hum yaha pe likhte hai head section. Mein. Okay. Next we write body. And at the end of the page, we need to close the body tag. And after that, we need to close the HTML tag. Okay. So in between the body tag, everything we will write here only. So first of all, you will write IMG. SRC is equals to. First, I am adding image only. Okay. So how you can write the image, how you can add the image, right click here. Properties. First, you need to copy the location. Copy and just paste it over here. Slash and then name of the image. Just copy it and then extension of the image that is type of file that is .png. So paste .png. .png. Okay. Save this file. Right. Save this file mimage.html save and you can see here where we have mimage.html here we have this file okay so you have to accept this is the output of this particular code if i want to change height width everything of this image uh, we can add image properties 
okay we have already discussed if if i want to change the height height is equals to let's say 40 percent see if height will be 40 percent okay i want to give it width width is equals to let's say 50 percent see if and refresh okay so height and width we have added here now i want to scroll this particular image so i write i will write mark you tag here and we need to close this tag here save and refresh so you can see how we can run this particular mark you tag with the help of image tag okay so i hope everything is clear here Okay, so this is how image is scrolling in your uh, web page. So, you can see here the speed of uh, this particular section is very low, very slow. Okay, if I want to increase the speed or if I want to uh, change the background color of this particular section, we can use some attributes of mark you tag. So, all these attributes, if I, if I want to change the speed of the image, ठीक है, so यहाँ पे हम हमेशा mark you के attributes add करते हैं. So for speed, what we need to do is scroll amount. Scroll amount is equals to let's say 30. Save and refresh. So you can see the difference here. If I increase it from 30 to let's say 60, refresh. Okay, so this is how you can run any image on your web page. Refresh. This speed is okay. Fine. Now I want to give background color. Okay. BG color is equals to. So BG color is equals to let's say red. Save and refresh. So this is the BG color. I hope everything is clear till now. Right? Now I am adding one uh, another image. IMG SRC is equals to. Let me just copy this again. Okay. Copy. And paste it over here. I am just adding IMG 4 now. So IMG 4. Save and refresh. Okay, so this is, let me just change the background color. This is very bright. Okay, so is tarha se ye cheeze kaam karti hai. Save and refresh. Okay, this is my image number four. Now I want to change I want to mark you this image also. Okay. So I am just using here M-A-R-Q-U-W. -E, remember the spelling. And then close the mark you tag. Save and refresh. Okay. Now I want to change the direction. I want this image to run from the opposite side of this particular section. From this particular web page. Okay. So, we need to write here direction is equals to direction is equals to right. Save and refresh. Okay. So, this is how direction attribute work with our image tag in mark you. Okay. Let's say loop. Loop se pehle I am just adding here speed. For speed right scroll amount is equals to 40 save and refresh so this is how you uh, your scroll amount feature will work on this image right as you can see it runs first round second round this is now we have the third round 
okay next round will be our fourth round now i want that after three rounds this image should stop working theek hai isme jo scrolling ho rahi hai that should be stop after three rounds so i am writing here loop is equals to 3 Say just increase the speed so that you can see the output in a fast way. So this is our first loop. A uh, check second image, okay? This is our second loop, and this is our third loop. So image will not come after the three loops because we have already added here three. If I write one only, so after one loop my image will disappear. जैसे कि ऊपर वाली इमेज में यू कैन सी दिस पर्टिकुलर इमेज इज रनिंग सो मेनी टाइम्स सो इफ आई वांट टू स्टॉप दिस पर्टिकुलर स्क्रोलिंग सो आई विल राइट लूप इज इक्वल्स टू लेट्स से फाइव हियर आई एम जस्ट इंक्रीजिंग इट्स स्पीड सो दैट यू कैन सी द आउटपुट इन अ फास्ट वे सी अपर इमेज वन टू थर्ड लूप फोर्थ लूप and this is its fifth loop that is the last loop okay after that yahan pe you can see this image has stopped working in between of the particular section okay this is how loop attribute always per uh, worked with your mark you tag with images okay so you can add here so many images we have so many options here okay if i add another image let's say img src is equals to control v img1 is tarah se save and refresh so this is our third image okay let's say again i am just copying this complete statement copy and paste okay so this will be image 2 dot png okay so yahan pe ye next line mein kyun nahi aayi this particular image because we don't used here br tag okay so is tarah se ye kaam karti hai cheeze so i hope everything is clear till now so if you want to add any attribute to any of the image you can always use mark you tag okay if you want to scroll any image to any direction to anything you can always use what you can always use mark you tag suppose if i created a table if i created a online form and i want to scroll that form i uh, i want to scroll that information so we need to add what we need to always add mark you tag okay so i hope everything is clear here so thanks for watching this